Since I just released my CD case mockup template, I wanted to show you how to use it. If you're a newbie or a beginner to Photoshop, this should be no problem because all you're basically doing is enabling and disabling layers. So the first one is lens flare. Here is where you get the color of the lens flare. Double click on the hue and saturation and change it to whatever color you like. Let's do that. Cool. Collapse the folder and the next one is effects. You turn it on and now you have the ability to have plastic or crack on the case. Let's just, in this case, let's just do plastic. Um, the case top and the case bottom, which are in red, leave those as B. They're locked already because you don't need to do anything with them. Uh, for J card distress, it basically gives you worn edges or a vintage look on the paper inside the case. So enable that. And you have soft or hard distress or the edges. Let me zoom in for this. You see the edges? They're soft and that's hard. Now on side art or album art, this is where you place your art. It's a smart layer. All you have to do is just double click it, add your art and you're done. So let's, in this case, let's do it to the side art. Double click. Cool. Make sure you flatten the image, save and close. Everything has changed. The background, the cover art and the side art. For the side art, you can basically customize the, the blur to your needs, but it will play off the colors of your original cover. You can either have blurry background, no blurry background or nothing at all. So with Gaussian blur, you can do the same thing with the side art. Having it a little blurry is like the sweet spot for me. Or if you just don't want any background at all, you could just do that or this to have transparency background so you could put it on anything, a poster, social media, etc. And that's it. It's a cool way to show off your album art with a couple clicks and it's highly customizable. So have fun. I want to see what you guys come up with. And uh, the link is below. So go ahead, copy it.